It's Wednesday, June 13th, 2018. We're in the Chiang Mai Airport shooting a video here on More Needs More. I stopped drinking 30 years ago. I stopped taking prescription drugs 30 years ago. I quit smoking 30 years ago. And I quit drinking coffee 30 years ago. But on my 30th AA birthday, I decided it might be a good idea to have some coffee. So I took my beloved girlfriend and we went to Starbucks. And Starbucks is a big deal here in Thailand. It's an American business that brings the quality and the class of service that's throughout the world in, from an American business. But I'm an addict. And instead of just having a cup of coffee, I had a double espresso. And by the end of the day, I had had five of them. Five double espresso lattes because more wants more. Anytime I'm looking for something outside of myself to feel, to fill what I feel on the inside, to fill that hole, that God-sized hole, I'm just gonna use and use and use and use. Now I like Starbucks, but coffee makes me crazy. It's, it's not a beverage for me, it's a drug. Now it may not be for you, but it is for me. And what I noticed was my feelings shut down. They became attenuated, they became numb. And you know the saddest part about drinking coffee for me was that I couldn't access my soul. I had a sponsee one time and he said to me, there's nothing that so much ensures severance from connection with a higher power as an energy drink. And that was exactly my experience. I couldn't find my immortal soul just because of coffee. Now this may not be true for you, this may be extreme for you, but it is my truth. I can't just do a little bit because more wants more. I'm an addict. Anytime I use anything, alcohol, drugs, cigarettes, caffeine, sex, food, anything, gambling, getting overworking, anytime I do that, I'm in a disease and addiction. More wants more. The solution, it's an inside job. The solution is within, it's not outside. If I look inside, I can find my heart, and then eventually, if I continue to work, the heart is the pathway to the soul, one day at a time. We'll see you tomorrow when we're in Hong Kong.